What's up YouTubers, it's your boy LB and welcome back to my new tutorial video. Guys, today in this video I have top 50 transition for you that I'm going to show you how to use this transition in Adobe Premiere Pro, how to import this preset inside Premiere Pro. So, and I will show you the different ways how to use this preset, this transition, this effect, yes, in Premiere Pro. So now we're going to jump into Premiere Pro. So, stick around. Alright, so guys, for here in this Premiere Pro, as you see here, I have some different clips which I'm going to use for adding this transition. And if you are... And if it is the first time to use this transition, first I'm going to show you how to import this transition and then after I will show you how to use it in different ways, okay? So now you have to come here for these double arrows and then I have to go here on this effect and then I have to open up this preset, okay? Guys, as I told you, that is the preset, that is the setting that have been saved. Someone who make this effect, this transition, and then they save as preset so now you have to open up this preset and then you right click here and then you click here on import preset okay so now you're gonna browse where your transition has been saved where your transition is saved my transition is saved here on the top 50 this one okay you see it has the format of preset okay so now you click on it and then you click here on open all right so guys as you see here you see this folder of 50 transition you see guys is already get in so now this is the different folders of this transition when you open up this color glitch there is some transition on for glitch when you open up for film lord there is some transition shake split glitch zoom stretch and other things okay so this is the full package you see the, it is the full package it is all in one so now and i'm going to show you how to use the transition okay you know guys transition uh, mostly they use between two clips okay between two clips okay so you see how the clip different clip it is i have different clips okay so and i'm going to see how to use this transition okay guys Let's see for the first frame and then you see how my clip it is. For example, this is the first method, okay? Here I can jump like five or 10 frames. Okay, you have to hold on shift on your keyboard and then you click these allow keys, okay? So now here I jump 10 frames and then I have to cut, okay? So, and then here guys, I can come and then let me set it by here. Let me cut it by here and then let me jump 10 frames. You hold the shift on your keyboard and then you jump 10 frames like this okay so and, and then for here guys for these small clips um, i'm going to add the transition for these small clips okay so for example let me open up this flash you see this flash i have to drag this flash and then i have to drop it here on this clip okay so when i play and you see how the this clip is you see guys you see this this is this is effect guys okay so guys if the for example if this effect it is going slow maybe you can add more frames for example let me use 20 frames i have to click on shift and then i have to move when i move when i click one yellow that it means it is five frames okay when i jump another it is 10 frames 15 and 20 yes okay and then i have to cut it so um, let me cut another 20 frames here one two three four and i have to cut here so now let me add this flash okay this flash effect and then when you play guys you see how these things it is okay so now guys this is the first method you can use for adding this effect even this for color zoom film load okay so but this flash you see it can works like a transition it can works like effect and even this glitch so okay so now let me go here between those 
between two clips and let's see how it is so this is the first clip this is the first clip and then this is the second one so i'm going to add the transition between those two clips and then you can ask yourself where can i add the transition okay so the things you have to do so you have to take just a few frames for the first clip and then other frames for the second clip and then you have to combine it together and then that layer you get is the one you have to add the transition okay so now let me do this so guys for this first clip so and i have to move this blue line here on the center of those two clips and then i have to hold the shift again and then let me take like 10 frames for each clip one two yeah this is 10 and i have to cut and then let me come back here on the center of those two clips and then i have to jump again and i grab two all 10 frames okay so now after getting those two things and then have to select it and i have to right click on it and i have to click here on next okay when you click here on next now i get one layer so now and i'm going to take like this the salted lore and then have to drag it here between those two clips okay so when i play guys and then you see how this transition leaves guys this is looks perfect and as i told you if you get or if you see this transition it is going too slow guys you have to add more frames okay depend what the frames you want okay so and let me do it again so let me take 20 frames for each okay maybe 20 or 15 okay so now i have to hold shift and then let me take like 20 frames maybe 20 frames it is a lot so let me take 15 okay so and let me take 15 here yes and i have to select it light click on it and then have to click here on next okay you see i get one nested sequence and let me take this top or yes you can take whatever you want okay let me take this top and then let me pray and let's see how it is guys you see how this transition it is yeah this is looks nice guys and then for example if you have like the sound effect guys you know there is sound effect for glitch sound effects like for smooth okay so you have to add that sound on it down there and then it looks good guys and then people guess man how they did this stuff guys as i told you you know editing it is a trick so you have to take your time then you have to do on it okay guys and then if you like these guys if you like this transition remember you can download it in the link description down below and then you can use it okay there is no problem okay so now let me add another transition here for this clip okay so now let me take like 15 frames okay and then let me take other one is here and i have light click and then have to nest together so let me take which which effect which transition can i take so let me use like color glitch okay this color glitch you see how it is let me see guys when you see these lead lines here you have to render first that means maybe this color glitch is too strong so now you have to select it mark in and mark out okay and then you press enter on your keyboard and then you have to wait why it is rendering okay so now you can you see the good preview okay you see how it is yeah this is how you you do these things okay so and let me take the other one like zoom let me take zoom stretch echo stretch grow yes can i take the zoom yes let me take the zoom okay and then let me put it the zoom transition here guys remember this it is not necessary to use 15 frames as i did okay so now you can use 
20, 25, depend. Depend what the transition you want to be. Okay. So for me, I like in this video, I like to use 15, 15 transition, uh, 15, 15 frames. Okay. But it is not necessary to use 15 or you can use less. Okay. So now let me use this one too. So when I play, you see guys, this is looks perfect guys. So guys, this is how you can use this transition. Either you can use this transition both between two clips or you can use this transition between one clip as effect as I did for this flash, even this shake guys. So now let me, for example, let me add this shake between this clip, okay. For yeah, inside this clip, I can cut and I have to choose like just few frames, okay? And then I have to come here and then let me open up this shake, for example. And when I play, you see it can work like transition, it can work like effect. There is no problem, you can use whatever you want guys i hope this video is very helpful to you so if you like my video please don't forget to make subscribe drop the comment down below i just want to know what you think leave the thumbs up like share yes and comment so see you in next video peace